Ah, não, falta aí, tô sentado, cadê? Ok. Mingle and gather information. You mean go pick up ah. stuff? Ok. Just to have a bit of money. I insist. <laughs> Stop. Excuse me. Hmm. Okay, let's talk to him. Can I offer you some of my premium ale, or perhaps some tobacco? Strictly on the quiet market. No, no. thank you. Oh, well, do you have any to sell then? Mm -hmm. Sorry. Please forget we ever spoke. <laughs> Already forgot it. <clears throat> I'll better get to climb it later. Hello. Welcome. Thank you. And what is your skill? Cleaning? Sewing? Cooking, perhaps? Infiltration. Mm, I prefer hunting. That's unusual. But you will find yourself in good company. Our dick site leader is also a woman. If you can get along with her, you'll do well here. Of course, everyone does well here. Our strength is using your strength. Wonderful. Great. What a strange place to put a box. Okay. Right now. Hmm. Eveline! What a joy to see you here and share the bounty of our life with a new sister. But why have you come? Were you not free already? When I heard how wonderful the community is, I had to see for myself. Are the rumors true? Are you as happy as they say? 
happier. Our homes are comfortable, food is good and plentiful. It's like Eden. Are you paid a good wage? We are allowed to live here and participate in the community, each of us helping in our own way. That's all the wage we need. Uh -huh. So the community owns this land. Someday we might, once we earn out our contracts. They say the land is valuable, so it may take a long time. It will be worth it. And if you should wish to leave? It doesn't happen. No one would ever want that. Uh -huh. No one has ever left. Shh. You shouldn't talk like that. No one here does. We're so full of happiness, we have no need of unpleasant thoughts. Or of those who would stir them. It really is so wonderful to see you again. Good day. Yeah, it always is. is. Everything is wonderful. Yay. Come on. Where's everyone going? Where did they get 500 monies? I want to climb that thing. Okay. What's the mission? Fashion a weapon. Hmm. <laughs> There's no shortage of material here. Perhaps I can gather the tools to arm myself so I'm ready when the time comes. Two belts. I'm just walking, I'm just walking, I'm just following you. What else did I pick up? Steel two knives. For making improvised hidden blades. the springs. No, we can't climb this. <laughs> that was very helpful. <laughs> Up here, up there. Come on. <coughs> Place a powder keg near the stables? Okay, that's a diary page. That's the statue.
That's the sink point. They said relics older than the Mayans. Did they find a fast civilization outpost? The box is over there, the cage is over there. Got something? Okay. I thought this was gonna happen. Okay. First of all, find the powder keg. Muskets. And he disappeared. What? Oh, sorry, I meant it. Whoa! No! Yo. A little crude, but it's better than nothing. Yeah, the colony's dark secret. Where is he going? Of course, you're correct. The company man is already displeased. If we had more people... More people? 
We've already exhausted the local labor supply. I brought workers from everywhere, as near as Cuba and as far as New Orleans. And in total secrecy, do you realize how complex and expensive that is? Be patient. Vasquez will soon be in place in New Orleans. He will succeed where Baptiste failed. Go, go, go. Here is the man I was mentioning earlier. What should we do with him? Educate him on the error of his ways. You Maybe didn't really think keeping? we'd let you violate your contract and run off with a head full of secrets, did you? Let's help the guy. Welcome. Thought you know. you come from Orleans. more importantly where will you go to new orleans i can arrange for employment ha huh. for what my people are the phone i will go back to africa good luck your locket is very unusual i've seen one before i assumed it was one of a kind it, it is. is one of a kind my mother made it with her own hands you must be mistaken no the woman who wore the locket was named Jeanne. She was one of the first workers to come here. I remember her fondly. But that was my mother's name. Where is this woman? I must see her. I don't know. She lived in a private house at the south edge of the camp. You should go. De Ferrer will be looking for you. Will you be all right on your own? Yes. I will hide until the changing of the guard at sundown and then make my escape again. This time, they won't catch me. Good luck. Good luck finding transport. Uh, complete mission in five minutes. Do not engage. I saw that! <laughs> hmm. 
Oh, still pick up. Page. Box. Box. Why is the tutorial stuck? Stuck. No. a lot of heavy sighing. This was my mother's. I'd know it anywhere. Jean's hat or Jean's hat? Jean's hat or Jean's hat? These could be hers. anything What did I miss? view of things. <laughs> oh, it's here. I am sorry I am late to our meeting, senor. I had to dispatch guards to hunt down another escapee. Third one this week, is it not? I am having him held for you. I know you like to deal with these matters personally. Always so considerate. I am rather in the mood for hanging. Have you given any further thought to my suggestion? Of doctoring the worker's ale? Haven't you had bad luck with poison before? Perhaps you're right. I don't want a repeat of the Macandal debacle. 
Archaeology is a fine, gentle work. I would prefer something that would not impair the worker's abilities. I suggest uh, another festival, a suckling pig. Tell them they are closer than ever to earning their land. Of course, you're correct. The company man is already displeased. Search for the lost prophecy disc. What? Nothing clues left behind by her long lost mother led Evelyn to a sea note entrance where her treasure hunt begins. What? Enter the sea note. Great. Fast. Mm. Navigate the caves. No, I have to. Where the hell am I? 
What? Aha, you're in Indiana Jones now. Kind of cute. Is that for civilization shit? going get back here that's what I wanted Damn, it's so slow.
too complicated. Ooh. Those who would supersede me in rank. You find pieces of the prophecy disc, saving me the effort. <laughs> if you weren't my enemy, I would take you for my friend. Our aims must not be so different for all the help you give me. I did the other thing. Come on. you climb the thing look it's so climbable look how climbable it is
What? Diving, keep diving, keep diving. Come on, you can dive. Dive, dive. Keep turning black for that, I don't get it. Incredibly annoying puzzle all over again. If only it rolled with some conviction.
that looks familiar. Kaboom. <laughs> How wonderfully useful you are. You remove those who... It's not E. It's P. Okay, let's go, bastards. Ah! Why don't you parry? Restart checkpoint. Can do this. Stop glitching my screen. <laughs> I paid you, mother. Okay, so I can't counter you in any freaking way. So lock on him, bring him down. I can't even focus with the screen glitching. bodies in Madeline's protection for your own safety. You and my heart. What cruel destiny brings you now? And carrying the blade of the enemy? Don't tell me. I thought you were dead. Please understand. They would have killed me. Taken my heart. I never wanted to leave you. Your temple. Is that it? Has Agate sent you here to kill me? Please tell me you do not hate me so much. I would not have left. Kill you? No, I, I, I came here on my own. Aveline, the disc can never fall into Agate's hands. If it did, 
everything I've been working to find and protect since leaving Nouvelle Orléans would be destroyed. How do you know him? And why are you so afraid? Long ago. No. I'm sorry, Evelyn. I hope you can forgive me someday. Mama! Where are you going? With the Ferrer dead and the slave colony free, Evelyn travels back to New Orleans. Upon her return, she finds a world very different than the one she had left. Yet the identity of the company man remains a mystery. Seventeen seventy one, New Orleans, home at last in Tide's town. Spanish rulers ease restrictions on the emancipation of slaves and encourage free trade. So mom is a Templar. Aveline! I... Gerald! You look as though you've seen a ghost. I left Chichen Itza the moment it was secure. Then you were... Uh, successful? De Ferrer... will no longer trouble us. But there is more to this story. Always. Oh. I have much to tell you as well. The Spanish are sympathetic to our aims now. New laws may ease your efforts to help the slaves. Could it be that for the first time, home holds more comfort than conflict? With you back, it feels like home again. I'm afraid I must now spoil your homecoming with business. There has been strange activity. Men in Spanish uniforms raising havoc in the bayou. Still? I thought you said Spanish interests are now aligned with ours. That's what makes it so... strange. Are they secretly working for... That's what we need to find out. I have one need. An informant has seen a man bribing soldiers in town. For whom? I'll investigate. Avin, aren't you forgetting something? Please, Gerald. Now is not the time. I um, uh, well, I merely meant to to give you. Didn't you put them back in the, in the oh, stash? Oh, uh, thank you. <sighs> it's been too long. Hmm. Assassin girl. Okay, let's do the thing. Ooh, New Orleans, the Jupiter. Cotton, cotton at 350, cotton at 380, cotton at 380, cotton providing, cheap for providing, okay. Buy cotton. Send to Veracruz. Can I buy a ship? Eight thousand. Nine thousand for a fast one. This will have to wait. I say assassin girl. Now I have my tools. Seigneur, 
je peux pas mourir. Weapon shop. Polish Merde. Naval X. Damn, that's expensive. Obsidian X. Damn, that's expensive. <laughs> More speed, more chain kills. I don't really use chain kills. Yeah, I'm thinking Officer Shell Sword. Apple Box. Lovely. A hundred thousand! <laughs> okay, I wanna save a hundred thousand for the pepper box. Medium fast poison. What is that gem thing? Are you a gym thing? <laughs> Maybe I should steal more. des habits d'homme.
Concord, Lexington, and Boston was just the beginning. Hey, you! <laughs> Trying to stop me. What is that symbol? Assassin's coin? What does that mean? Mm. There he is. Get up. <laughs> Target is too far away. <laughs> As you can see, my employer is prepared to be very generous. So it seems. Then you will join our cause? See. Si. Stop her! By the way, switch this to heal. Now what do we do? Huh. 
Give me a second. There are boxes. Last week. Is this contracts? Student, an important matter has come to my attention. A known criminal has arrived in New Orleans to join the ranks of the enemy. He has been promised protection and a new life here. Disguised as a noble, he awaits his first orders. This must not come to pass. Je vous présente mes respects. What is assassin coin? Elle est rapide. Aha. I need to use the hidden blade. That wasn't beating up, right? Okay, what is Assassin's Coin? to mention huh. 
Maybe I should reduce a bit of notoriety. If your purse is heavy enough. I need to go slave. <laughs> Remain undetected. That means hidden blade and poison dust. Yeah, I need to take care of the watchers. Hurry! She's winning! She'll get away! Hurry! She's winning! <laughs> she's winning. Hurry! She's winning! Hurry! She's winning! Losing her! Very short range. Use a powder keg. Well, he just passed one. the wrong button. Damn, there was another one here. Walking over there again. That's the tower.
I'll loot him. Mm. Seriously, loot him. Catch the murder. Her. I'm losing her! Whoa. Come on. Can't whistle and climb at the same time.
good. Let's make it even more fun. <laughs> oh, come on, didn't even hurt anyone. Okay, the rest seem busy. I must sink that tower. Signor, perhaps you underestimate the vast, winding expanse of the bayou. I will repeat, I need enough men to control all of it. Recruit the entire Spanish army if you must. Yours in absolute discretion. Vasquez. Mm. Vasquez? De Ferrer mentioned him in Chichen Itza. Is he the company man? I must warn Agate and the smugglers. I think 67%. Yeah, well. Travel to the bayou. One moment. Be right back. Okay. Traveling to the bayou.
The pain, the agony. Wait, touch the body. Contracts. Mademoiselle Aveline, conspiracy is afoot at the docks. What now? With full support of the government, the Mughal shipwright Salmon fixes impossibly high prices for ships and repairs. Good thing I don't work for the government. Please, find him at the docks and introduce him to a higher law. Sure thing. <laughs> Kill the town using the lady persona. <laughs> really? Can we not? <laughs> I have no chamber near here. Okay, there is one over there. Okay, I guess it's gonna be my, the special concoction. I will arrest you for that. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> one of you.
Okay, Lure. Okay, mission. Hey, you! Stop! No. What do you want? Beat up the trader and steal the ship's deed? My pain, my suffering, it all starts with you. Come on, man. Have some self-respect. What's the trouble now? My ship, gone. Money, gone. Wife, I never even had a wife. And this man, he says, oh, Capitan, I am so poor. I am so generous. I lent him money. He buys a ship. He becomes rich. Now I go to him. I say, oh, Capitan, I am so poor. And he refuses to pay me back. Quit your crying and clean yourself up. I'll take care of it. Oh, oh, thank you. But only if you sober up enough to make yourself useful. Uh, uh, uh... You do that. Be the potato. God damn you. with the generosity of Capitan Dominguez, you won't be needing it anymore. I, uh... oh, very well. I have retrieved the man's ship. You may use it now. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Now you are in my protection. You will repay this kindness by working for me. Mm -hmm. If that is my only option, I accept. I mean, I, it would be my great honor. My sweet and gentle Angel. Is that the of the blade? Of course, of course, provided you can. Hmm. Assume we can. Take it, take it. <coughs> oh, are you so bad at interpreting what I want? Contacts later. What? What is that? What is that? <laughs> oh. Never mind. Back to the body, mm. to the New Orleans, please.
After discovering a plot to force her mentor out of hiding, Evelyn journeys to the bayou, determined to win back Agatha's trust and refusing to give up on the Brotherhood. Quelle tenue est-ce là? I would be happy to help a fellow in need. Uh huh. Hmm. What do you need? Find the mushroom. Aveline, I had hoped you would return. What is the matter with these poor souls? It is an infection. They believe it is a curse. But in truth, only a medicine drawn from a rare fungi will save them. How can I help? Find that fungi. The fungi is vexing to collect. Like the riddle says, Think or dangerous, high or low, where none dare tread, the fungi grow. And of late I lack agility, if not daring. Say no more. I will find it for you. Just point me in the right I know of a place you may find some. Please hurry. You may need to cut more than once before you have enough. Find the mushroom. Get it. My nose it just Come on. Aveline, just in time. Please, can you help me give them the medicine? I am afraid it may take a little uh, force. With the fever, they are not of the right mind. You are certain this will work? I am not in the habit of harming civilians. I am certain. And observe, under the fever's influence, they are hardly civil. Of a deal. <clears throat> ah, good. They will thank you later. <laughs> One day. Please, there are many others who will need your help. If you can find more mushrooms, you will find no shortage of patients who need it. Let's see what I can find. Nah. I'm starting to dislike the bio.
Come on. Grab it. Why aren't you grabbing it? Yeah, break your neck. That's how you <laughs> cure fever. about the weather. <clears throat> Never mind. We'll explain. I already killed two gators. Superstitions of the weak against themselves. Excuse me? Agate. Who... Who are you? You look like a faithful student I had once. Long ago. She no longer exists. Mentor, I know you have doubted me. But please, my absence has not been in vain. Look what I found. You should have left it where it lay. Do you have any idea of its purpose or power? I was hoping you could enlighten. Had you not insisted on dredging it up, no one would need to know. Remove it from my sight. Bury it and forget the spot. Grind it into powder. Plant it under an alligator nest. Let me never lay eyes on it again. What's the Very again? well. I had thought you would accept it as confirmation of my loyalty. My... Someone told me you were looking for it. You should not allow gossip to infect your mind. Now be gone! Not before I warn you, Mentor. You are not safe here. Have I not been telling you this for years? Useless child. This threat is new and very real. A man, Vasquez. I am aware. He bribes Spanish troops. But I already have plans to outwit them. I will use their superstition against them. Let me help. I know I cannot stop you. You will see. My loyalty is real. Very well. Listen closely. See if you can follow this plan. I have planted signs, which our dear European friends find terrifying. If you are able to follow the instructions, you may tail them from sign to sign and eliminate them silently, giving the appearance of a voodoo curse. Boo! And then? 
A curse may frighten them, but will it be enough to stop the flow of new recruits? More questions. I thought you were here to help. Ah, silence at last. Go now before you spoil this moment. You're annoying. Switch to poison dots. Look, it's it's. Uh. <laughs> How childish can you be? It is nothing. Wh what are you doing? What do you think? I'm removing it. You can't. We'll be cursed. Oh, we'll be cursed. Truly, I'm terrified. <gasps> it's true! <laughs> Move out! It's not safe here! Say you want to remove it, come on. Dio Santo, more voodoo! Deserter! Come back! I will have you <laughs> torn marshaled! Hmm. It's funny. Oh wow. Keep okay. moving, man! And this time keep your eyes open and wait about you. May God watch over us. Damn it. Deserter! Come back! I will have you <laughs> torn marshaled! <laughs> oh, that was a really slow Keep moving, man! And this time, keep your eyes open and wait about you. May God watch over us. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Give me my camera back. Take care of the fever. Very convenient that uh, um, oh. Hang on a second, I need to climb a tree. This will do. Oh. <laughs> no, take your medicine. Don't send me to the other side of the bayou. Mademoiselle Aveline, a shady character, Monsieur Reynaud, if that is his real name, diverts goods through the bayou to the black market, thanks to ties with the Spanish military. What else is new? Besides the heat and the alligators, his headquarters are near the fort. I'll go apply a little heat of my own. Take no damage. How far is it? Take the boat. What the hell is going on? Weird places.
What is this? Okay, what's up? Bonjour, smugglers! Evelyn! <laughs> it's been a long while. Too long. Listen, have you noticed any unusual activity on the bayou? <laughs> Other than ours, you mean? <laughs> <laughs> uh, we have been noticing rather a lot of... Uh, men in Spanish uniforms. <laughs> Although I would question both their manhood and their allegiance. They've been bribed by a man named Vasquez. He works for the... Vasquez? Sacre bleu, I know his name. I heard soldiers talking. He plans to divert a supply ship tomorrow. Unless we divert it first. <laughs> I like how you think. Have I not said it before, Elise? I love how she thinks. I'm in the mood for a diversion myself. If I may make a suggestion. The lighthouse on Lake Pontchartrain. If you uh, tamper with it, perhaps that ship may never reach her berth. Roussillon, I like how you think. Have I not said it before, Elise? <laughs> I love how he thinks. <laughs> we can idiots. Avoid killing anyone. Oh, they come? Okay. Are you done peeing or whatever?
Do not kill anyone. Before I do that, synchronize. Now let's fix that lighthouse. Okay. drunk already were you not more fun when we met i seem to remember nothing you remember nothing right because i'm so drunk <laughs> idiots aveline you've done it the ship she is stuck in the mud now you will reap your reward and i will cut vasquez down to size and then we celebrate aveline i'll gather my men We'll meet you at the ship. And the plundering will begin! You shouldn't come. What's this? Hmm, Kalo. More poison, more cartridge. I haven't actually used enough to merit this in any case. Let's get the page. <coughs> Climb this wretched tree. Is there a way up through here? I guess so. Hmm. 
<clears throat> what the hell did you do? that thing. I want to get to the tree. Uh, never mind. The fungus. Ah, Elise, are your men ready? <laughs> <laughs> ready? <laughs> they can barely contain themselves. Please, help me do something about those guards before our men rush the ship and get shot full of O. Kill Spanish soldiers. Two crates by myself. I'm carrying Right. 
You loot the ship, I loot the girls. Oh look, all the guards. Still fighting. Wow, Aveline, that was spectacular. I'm only sorry Vasquez wasn't on board. No, no. I wouldn't be too sorry just yet. Perhaps this will be of help. Okay, I like you again. Documents found aboard the Spanish ship contained orders to travel to Shitsenize and they claimed the war site. Touring for her mother's safety and perhaps hoping to find the second half of the prophecy disc, Evelyn returns to Chikenize. Cost you like everything. Hmm. What do you want? Hey, Senorita, a word, Senorita? Yes, Capitan Dominguez says you are fast. Capitan Dominguez says you can climb. Capitan Dominguez says... All right, all right, enough about Capitan Dominguez. What do you want? To race you and prove I am faster. What do I get when you lose? <laughs> if I lose, I will be happy to serve on your crew. You have a deal. Uh, Wait, that wasn't the same? Many of us. Um, restart this. Climb down and through. Mm. 
Oh, damn it. Okay, again. Come on! Have a pistol now. Use the freaking pistol. Pistol? Here. Shoot him! Shoot him! God damn it! Hmm. Did you learn nothing from what I just said? Thank you.
<clears throat> Come on. Come on. <laughs> What is the mission? You're not telling me. Okay. I'm going default assassin. No, you said go back to to that place. I'm going default assassin. Quite finished. Is that all you got? Um, dude. Come on, man. Fight me. Try. Um, you're on the ground. You're unconscious. You want to fight? I'm so terrified. You're dead. Okay, let me hide. Okay. Return to Mexico. Before I go back to Mexico, uh, Shison is there. That leads south again to the missing pieces of the puzzle. Aveline, you have returned. Mama, you're not afraid of me. Aveline, I have passed more years missing you than mothering you. If I cannot know you now that you are returned to me, then why have I waited all this time? My love is stronger than my fear. You are no assassin. You are my daughter. I'm an assassin. Will you ever understand why I had to leave? We. Oui. You thought your life was in danger. Your father made me free, but I could never be free in Nouvelle Orléans. Not with the assassins watching. Are you free here? No. 
I traded one enemy for another, and they will not rest until they have what they seek. The missing shard of the disk. As long as it is here, I will always feel their eyes on me. But if someone were to remove it, someone strong and resourceful... I might know someone like that. <laughs> if you see her, please give her this map. And let her know about the old canoe that remained in the cenote after our last expedition. Tell her to go quickly. Somehow they are watching. If she was to be discovered, we would both... Fear not, Mama. You will know peace soon. Oh, that's so cute. Sorry. Be right back. Get to the canoe. Why is my canoe showing them stats? Just bumped it a bit. I can do <laughs> no way to do it gently.
Where would I want to drop? Okay. Lovely. Shot for traps. So when do we have traps? Ow! Charge a bit of health. Up, up, up. Up, up. Come on. That's horribly convenient. Wait, what am I missing? Yeah, I see you. Mm. 
Okay. All the puzzle in five moves or less. The beam must be reflected off the prisms so that it reaches the receiver. Okay. Got it. Let's move a tile. I'm selecting Ah, uh, I only get to move them the other way. Now who shows up? No one? Evelyn, were you successful? Do not show me. I have seen too much already. I need never lay eyes on it again. Mama, I will return to New Orleans and set everything right. Then I will send for you. My dear tenacious daughter, I want nothing more than to be close to you again. But this colony is my place now. The people here need me. Nouvelle Orléans will always be haunted. I understand. Don't worry. This will not be the last you see of me. Be careful. Not the last you'll My see child. of me. Yeah, well. Nouvelle-Orléans. Having secured the second part of the prophecy disc, Evelyn travels back to New Orleans to continue the search, her search for Vasquez, the man she believes is the company man. Seventeen seventy-three. Despite the success in Chihuahua Saint Nazaire, the bitter sweet reunion awaits at home. Parents are disapproving. <laughs> An urgent favor. Wait, what's happened over there? Okay. Immediate lady girl, huh? Papa? Papa, you're the face of death. What does the doctor say? <coughs> Do not worry, ma chérie. 
It is only... <coughs> Papa! <coughs> oh, my dear love, do not frown so. Between your worry and your stepmother's tonic, the malady hurts less than the cure. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jeanne. You were always so protective of that locket. I have always regretted... Evelyn, I am sorry for interrupting, but I need your assistance. It is urgent. Of course. I love you, Papa. Don't die too quick. There is a slave, George. I promised him safe passage to the north, but during his escape he was discovered by soldiers. He hides, but... Please, is there anything you can do with your business booming and your contacts in the bayou? Oui. I will get him to safety in utmost discretion. I love the tiny pistol hanging at the belt. Okay, leave the mansion. I can leave as a lady and leave as a slave. Okay. Find Georges. Nos chemins se croisent à nouveau. Okay, so what's the deal with this guy? Jeweled brooch. Je vous souhaite le bonjour. Come on. Ugh. Okay, what do I do with all of it? How do you get up there? Really? You want to climb a ladder? Fine. I'll just switch out the second I can. Oh, bonjour. Pardonnez-moi, mademoiselle. Oh, bonjour. I'd rather just run on the rooftops. Huh? 
I'm just gonna climb the church, okay? Okay. Unlock weapons shop. Okay, 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 okay. Unlock Taylor. Okay, okay. Okay. Son tailleur est un criminel. Non criminal. Assassino. What ally? When did I have an ally? So it's okay if I just go through here, but I can't well, go through well. there. You sh Engage in open conflict. No good back. What? My, my, it must. Pretty biddy. Care for a dance? Do not engage. Do not engage. Care for a dance? You're a dance. Yeah, a bell just a slave carrying a musket, no one stops her. Who are you? What are you? No one said anything about avenging angels or 
Go. Find safety in the bayou. Find this island, Rosalio, and tell them I sent you. Despite her father's ill health, Evelyn continues her search for the man called Vasquez. to Spanish supply the revolutionary rebels. What? What the hell happened? Evelyn! Who is this? George. A friend. We have a situation I'm hoping you'll help with. Evelyn, a friend of yours is a friend of ours. But uh, we've got a situation of our own brewing. Our... Um... Spanish friends want us to hand these supplies over to some, how do you say, patriot, at the edge of the swamp. Patriots. Well, you know, from the north. A rebellion, upheaval, etc. A business opportunity by any other name. But for some reason, the Spanish soldiers keep trying to steal the supplies back. This what? sounds awfully familiar. You don't think... Oh, I try never to think. <laughs> Suppose George and I were to help you with your rogue Spanish soldier problem. Would your patriot friends escort him north? If they want more supplies, they'll accept. Good. Let's go. That must retain 50% health. Don't swim. Use only melee weapons. <laughs> Oh, damn it, there's more. They're going to kill us. I'm trying to stuff. Ha <laughs> 
There's an outpost up ahead. Clear it before they see us. up ahead. Clear it before they see us. How do I get back to the boat? <laughs> Why aren't you catching the thing you're supposed to be catching? There's an outpost up ahead. Clear it before they see us. Get <laughs> what am I supposed to do from here if they won't catch oh finally it catches see anything. Oh, there it is. I can't see her! Oh. Oh. 
Hop, hop. Ahoy. Hopton. 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 Enchanté. These are the goods? Everything the governor promised. And a few uh, bonus items from your friends in the bayou. Excellent. You weren't detected, I hope? It's taken Not care by of. any who still breathes. Yeah. <laughs> Monsieur Hopton, how secret is your arrangement with our Spanish gouverneur? Any fool can see the Spanish want to keep the English out of their territory. Any sense why Spanish soldiers would be shooting at us? We did meet one man who didn't seem so keen on the arrangement. Contrary fellow. Vasquez, I think was his name? The company man is here. The what man? <laughs> <coughs> uh, Monsieur Hopton, if you want your supplies to make it out of La Louisiane, additional security would be wise. May I suggest George accompany you? Certainly. If he's willing to fight, the Patriot cause will be glad to have him. I will fight for you, sir. Over any cause. Be careful, Monsieur Hopton. I hope to see you again. Um, Monsieur Roussillon and I value your business. I will. The uh, Patriots value your support. Well, if, if the money's there. Right, the tree. Move, move. How do I get up that tree? No, climb. Not there yet. I think that was the last one. Yep. Okay. How the hell don't I have fast travel? Never mind. I just swing the whole way.
Anyone else wants to get in my way? Contracts. Êtes-vous une sorte d'or? Mademoiselle Aveline, we have a problem that needs a woman's touch. A question of supply and demand. True. We are in short supply in New Orleans. No, I uh, meant, um, raw materials. Tobacco, cotton, sugar. The enemy has won over a key producer, <clears throat> Monsieur Marcantel. He is famously social. But one needs a certain charm, grace, and status to move in his circle. I'll manufacture a reason to pay him a visit. Time your target remain undetected. quickly change. Let's get some change.
Comment allez-vous A pretty dress you've got there. Yeah, I'm keeping it. Ooh, there's a page here. Two pages. How about you follow me to a secluded location where I'll stab you? Everything is so open here. This seems like a good place. That's it, we're good. What is this? Did you get the nice hat? My mother gave it to me. Tell me you do not believe them. <laughs> A small gesture. Hardly enough. I can offer them a wage, but what good is money without freedom? One day, it will come. Or you will make it. I know it. And in the meantime, what? I should congratulate myself while every day they face abuse, or worse? The Templars will never allow slaves to be free. They keep even the rich in bondage. Though most people would never suspect. Gerald, if my father hadn't freed my mother... I'd be in the same predicament. But he did. I still owe them better.
Let me check on the ships. Oof. Okay, we've got one here. They're producing water and lemonade. Fruit. Who wants fruit? They want fruit. New York wants fruit a lot. Let's go to New York. 21 minutes. 20% chance of pirates. Yes. How about buying a new ship out of New Orleans? Something with a lot of cargo space. Victorios. By molasses. Four hundred for molasses. Five seventy. Six twenty. Boston, it is. Ugh. Oh, they're traveling. Um, East Indiaman, too pricey. One thirty-eight fifty, one fifty sixty, one seventy-five seventy. Let's grab that. And get some cotton. Some cotton to New York. Hopefully, this will work. Gerald, the last I mean, Gerald, he is back. Vasquez, the company man. Have any of your informants seen him? No. Aveline, since last week I have lost two of my men. Killed. Poison. <sighs> this is his work. I must find him. Perhaps he will attend the Capitan's Ball this evening. Shall I confirm your attendance? Oui. Thank you, Gerald. And, um, Evelyn, I... Uh, you will need someone to accompany you. <laughs> I don't suppose... Gerald, are you asking to accompany me? Uh, well... Oui. For, um, blending purposes, I believe it would be best. Strictly business, <clears throat> of course. Of uh -huh. course. But not too strict, I hope. Yeah, there might be something there. Mingle and talk. Don't you want to dress up a bit? Revolution! <laughs> what a noble concept! Oh, it's of coming course, to France. War is always good for business. Particularly a war that's not in our territory. The good Spanish governor provides the goods, I relay them to my associates in the bayou, and they handle the transfer. Completely bloodless. <laughs> for me! <laughs> <laughs> ah, Aveline, lovely as ever. How does your father fare? Stubborn, as always. I look forward to seeing him on his feet soon. You must allow me one dance, that I may showcase your grace in your father's stead. That is very kind, Mr. de saint Maxin. And if you could perhaps waltz me by your esteemed associate in the blue cravat, I have a business opportunity I'd like to put before him. Evelyn, always so serious. 
Nothing like my daughter Marie Felicité. She probably preached. I got no money back. He need the uniform. He is no true military man. I assure you. Twice, the recruiters have approached me, claiming to offer me promotion if I'll serve in his secret unit. But I don't trust it, no, senor. Good man. We could use more young men like you, with a head on their shoulders. Good evening, senorita. Uh, you look familiar. Uh, were you at the governor's dinner party last week? <laughs> I'm so sorry, I don't remember your name. Perfectly understandable for a man with such important affairs as yours, Capitan. Thank goodness for your service in the colony. The thanks is all mine, senorita. Will you allow me to express it with a dance? Why, certainly, Capitan. I should warn you to be careful, senorita. Even here at this delightful party, danger is present. All soldiers are not what they appear. We were just discussing a terrible man. How scandalous! Is he here tonight? He is, at this moment, seated at a secluded table. Until the gavotte, Capitan. I shall think of nothing else. I should marry. <laughs> uh, whichever of us is the best dancer. You would have me dance with all of you. I shall be exhausted. Please, senorita, allow me to save you the trouble. You need only dance with me. <laughs> Marie Felicité, I thought the Duce Maxon girls only had eyes for governors. Now, who is this? Senorita, give us your name. ...that we may know how to address the fairest woman at the ball. Fair? <laughs> I think not. But still, your complexion is beguiling. Uh, please, senorita, allow me to complete your dance card. Dance I'm card. afraid it's already full. That is simply her way. Have you heard? She prefers her father's warehouse to tea parties. Never calls on any of us. And her complexion? <laughs> of she is a dear friend of the family, but her mother? It is shocking. Don't despise my mother. Senorita. Why, I do believe the minuet is the next dance, Senor Vasquez. Si, si. Dances. Can we retire somewhere private to discuss it? Si, si. Lead the way. Oh, you know exactly where. Okay, there's a guard over there. Chip chip at the right spot. I got some money.
Uh huh. Wait, what? Where are we going? Hang on. I misunderstood. Come here. There we go. Are you coming? <laughs> so, uh, stabby. Good night, company man. He's not a company, company man. man. <laughs> no, you are mistaken. What? <laughs> Futile murder. And beautiful death. She will make you suffer. Just don't let it be my mother. Alright, I'm not gonna reach that. Madeleine, Avelyn, I did not know you were attending. I came only to find you. How could you? A ball with your father on his deathbed. I... Save your words. It is too late. He is gone. What? Papa! No. I had to kill someone. I am so sorry, but you had to know with your circumstances that he could not leave you anything. Of course, my house remains open to you. I care not about his will, only that he has gone. His business is in my name, but I consider it yours. The law has no place between us. Can you slide? Yeah. She can slide. <laughs> Mademoiselle Aveline, the overstuffed textile trade bursts with corruption. How unseemly. And the enemy is to blame? Yes. A single textiler, Monsieur Chaperon, keeps prices tightly knotted. I'll sew this up as quickly as possible. Oh, the puns. Je vous souhaite le bonjour. There we go.
What is that? Bolas? I can punch. Mama? Escort the man to safety. Evelyn, do you remember the slave you brought me, Therese? Yes. Of course. Can I trust you, daughter? Always. But with what? There is another slave, a man. He was separated from his wife and son. Hmm. If you can bring him to me, I can reunite them. Oh, of course. I will help in any way I can. I do not need to know the way. <sighs> yes, Mama. Find the slave, take no damage. Bonjour, Madame. Fight enemies and free the slave. I show you how we do it in space. Ah! Oh, what? Thank you, but there is no time. Come with me quickly. Where? To your family. Hang on, looting, looting some more. Who's that? Come here. Merci. Oh, new message. Go north and search of the company. Although man. the reconstruction of our network has required an investment of several years, the help of our American friends means we can now reach further than before. One of our newest informants sends word of a loyalist in New York who might, with a little pressure, unmask the company man. Please go to New York and find your brother Connor. I have enlisted his help in locating Officer Davidson of Lord Dunmore's Ethiopian regiment. Brother Connor? The original Connor? Evelyn paid a heavy price for killing Vasquez, whom she learned was not the elusive company man. Unable to be with her father in his dying hours, she begins to doubt her course of action. Her loyalty to the Brotherhood falters, and she's wearing Frontier Guard. 1777, New York, years pass, business prospers, but the company man remains at large. Finally, an informant tip forms a great voyage to the frontier. Meet Connor. Okay, so it's... let's uh, okay, get a on. Connor? I'm Aveline de Grand Prix, your brother from New Orleans. Yes. Oh. Achilles told me you would come. I seek a loyalist, Officer Davidson, of Lord Dunmore's Ethiopian regiment. That regiment passed through here. Look at the destruction they left. Their trail leads this way. We will follow them carefully. Over there, through the trees. A trap. Keep after the sentry. I will hold off these men. Come here, you. Unhand me! One chance to keep your life. Where is Davidson? Who? Come on, time's up. 
He's in the fort. That was easy. Why is it you call yourselves loyalists again? <laughs> Easier to be loyal in the safety of the fort than out in the snow with a knife to your neck. Run home, now. And don't let me see you again. You won't be able to run then. Yes, ma'am. Yes, run. <laughs> to the fort! So, climb the ice wall. We climb. <laughs> okay, I can climb as fast as she can. It's not gonna go any faster. I have to keep Connell safe. Connell's much better equipped than Evelyn. I'll show you a thing or two. Yeah, sure, let's take the musket. Coming. Didn't you be coming? Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm not going to use the axe for this. Can you get across? Can you? You got to keep the musket. Okay, I got it. Through the trees. Can you find a way in? 
I will go around and divert attention. Screaming and sliding so much. <laughs> yeah, we're not going easy this time. We've got you now. <sighs> <clears throat> Muskets suck. Won't get away now. Whoa, he flew really high. Oh, just finished this mission. Officer Davidson, if you would kindly pay me the respect my rank commands now. Fighting for the British? And working for my enemy who would enslave you? I'll say something's rank. <laughs> ha! The loyalists have guaranteed my freedom. I will fight for it and win it for myself. Come at me. Meanwhile, the slaves and the poor are targets in New Orleans, and you play the hero in New York. Who do you serve? And do you really think yourself free? Charity should begin at himself, Miss Aveline. You asked for it. Okay. Ideas. <laughs> Come on.
Okay. <laughs> up the stairs, up the wall, up the wall, <laughs> up the wall to the right, slightly down, over there, <laughs> climb there, climb this to the right. Up, 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 from here, to there. <clears throat> Shoot the barrels. I had hoped it would not come to this. Now, in death, eternal freedom. You mock me. I chose my destiny. That is real freedom. Perhaps one day you will know it too. I... Who is the company man? <laughs> the answer has been in your own backyard all along. Just... Open your eyes. <sighs> I really hope it's not Mama. Did you find what you sought? We, oui. and much that I didn't. Connor, are you always certain in the means and ways of the Brotherhood? I trust my own hands. Of course. Travel safely. It's the arrival that concerns me. <laughs> then you are on the right path. George Davidson gave just enough clues as to the identity of the company man. It is with a heavy heart that Evelyn returns home. Seventeen seventy seven, New Orleans, the truth uncovered, the logical conclusion awaits. Which is <laughs> Which is to get the box. And hmm. the page. Stop complaining.
What's going on here? Let me show you my special Erudito cut. Discover what they did not want you to see. Where is it? Discover what they did not want you to see. I'm trying. Here is something they have left out. Where is it? Obviously, it's complicated. <clears throat> Papa, I'm not... Why did you leave? I would have married you if I could. You know my arrangement with Madeleine was... his business. Now she convinced me. If the law was different... How, how can you ever forgive me? What? I don't know, Papa. What? That's rats. Excusez-moi, madame. You're excused. It's just cute. Of course, it's the mansion. I want a pistol over here. Pistol over here.
Aveline, what a pleasant surprise. I trust you had a safe journey? Safety? Ha! <laughs> what a quaint concept. Aveline, are you well? You may quit your maternal act, company man. I'm well aware of your true identity. <laughs> oh, Aveline, do not be so angry. Do you think that I do not know where you go when you climb through your window to the rooftops at night? How you play the dainty daughter to your doting father? How you pretend to blend with slaves of all people? As if you could conceal your true self from me. <laughs> My dear, sweet stepdaughter. You are alive today because I needed you. Because I still need you. For what? Sit down. Escape. Oh boy. Stop right there! A little late for that, don't you think? My men will kill you. Then what will be left of your precious brotherhood? At ease. We have others. Look at us. So sad. How many years have we worked together for the slaves? <laughs> you kept them enslaved on your own terms, out of sight for your ill gain. You ended that, as was my intention. Monsieur de Ferrer had different ideas. He perverted my peaceful colony into something ugly. You had to kill him. I owe you gratitude. I don't believe you. Aveline, I love you. I raised you as my own. I was unable to bear children, but you brought light to my life. My whole life you lied to me. I am sorry. It was necessary. A mother's duty is to protect. But look at me now in the light of truth. You who know so well the pain of a life lived in secret, shrouding your power in petticoats and lace, <laughs> pretending obedience to men who deny you the right to your own abilities. Am I really so strange to you? I needed you to quash the terrorist elements in my organization. I need you still. I cannot let the assassins waste your talents. You are too valuable to me. As a tool to manipulate? I know you have been frustrated. Agate. I disobeyed. De Ferrer would still live if he had his way. You see, your aims match mine. Join me, Aveline. Finish what you started. Following a confrontation with the company man, with Elaine de Lizelle, her beloved stepmother, Evelyn finds herself confused and alone. She journeys to the bio to seek a goddess counsel and test her own faith in the Brotherhood. And this is where I'll stop for now. After this cutscene. Agate! The student returns. Why? What use have you suddenly found for old Agate? I have discovered the identity of the company man. What? Did you not kill him years ago? That was not the company man. <laughs> you ignored my warning, and now you see your error. It was your responsibility to know as much as mine, Agate. I was a child when you brought me into the Brotherhood and made me an assassin. You pretended to protect me, to root out the enemy. And all along, my own stepmother, Madeleine, was the company man. <sighs> Iniquity runs in the family. Shut up. Agate, stop! Recover your senses! No! It cannot be! What? Thank you, Meet. Agate! What have you done to me? The order is the future. Who? Damn it, come on. What? <laughs> Thank 
Thank you, Meat Manager, for following, and thank you, Demation, for following earlier. The locket you wear. I know it well. But you... Come on. God damn it. God damn it. Agate, stop. Recover your senses. No. It cannot be. Agate, what have you done to me? Hey, what are The order is the future. What? Go ahead, assassin. The locket you wear. I know it well. But you... God damn you, stop it! <laughs> Does your conscience attack you? Agate! Stop! That day, when the sailors attacked you, I should not have intervened. I thought you had the spirit of a warrior. Like your mother. But you only take after your father. That waxy, pale slave master. What the hell is going on here? <clears throat> you have no right. You! Stop! Our aims must be. Really? Kill him? I'm gonna take his money. Uh, what do you mean kill him? I'm I'm attacking. Can't you see I'm attacking? I can't even target him. You in that? Stop! Nothing more. Just open your eyes. What the hell is going Agate. on? Agate! It doesn't have to be like this. The shards of the Chichen Itza disc. Work with me. Tell me what they are for. Wait, how did we do this? Like this. I told you never to speak to me of that. The knowledge, it will destroy us all. Why are you so scared? <laughs> 
And without it, we will continue to stumble blindly towards what? Not towards. Away! Put it from your mind! Mentor, do not force my hand. The Agate who trained me is a man of truth and courage. I know he still lives within you. Let him out again. Oh. What have I wrought? I should have stayed with your mother. You should have been my child. Raised as a daughter. Not twisted into this... Monster. I'm not a monster. You're a monster. Go now, Agate. Run. And promise never to return. <clears throat> you would bid me a coward's slow, pointless death? As you did Uyoa! I will not live with the dishonor! I... Agate! No! Oh well. Agatha's failure as an assassin and his lack of trust in Eveline leaves her completely adrift. She returns to Madeline, ready to embrace her stepmother's cause. Really? <coughs> I have done as you asked. He is dead. And the disc? You look different. Do you swear to uphold the principles of our order and all that for which we stand? I do. To never share our secrets nor divulge the true nature of our work? I do. And to do so from now until death? Whatever the cost, I do. Then I welcome you into our arms, sister. Together we shall usher in the dawn of a new world, one in which our hands will ensure that all things find their proper place. My daughter, you are one of us now. May the Father of Understanding guide us May the Father of Understanding guide us. Okay, what's the real... Oh, yeah, that's it? Okay, that was quick. I didn't think it was going to be that quick. <laughs> there has to be something more. Yeah. That's him. Okay, what's the truth? Oh, 
does not work! Why can't I understand? It cannot be! I refuse to believe it! All these wasted years, a lifetime of sacrifice and... We have all the pieces, I am certain of it. Unless... The locket. The locket. Any damage. You can blame Chichen Itza and De Ferrer, but I see through you. My daughter... No! <laughs> daughter? Only two people can call me that. You banished one and sacrificed the other. Foxglove! You killed my father with your care and your tonic. Why? Because he never truly loved you? And Jeanne? My mother, you stole her child and <clears throat> sent her away. You kept her enslaved even after my father had freed her. And now you attempt to return me to that fate. In the service of humanity, in work, the purpose for which you were created. We were created. The highest purpose. I will not serve you. No! Uh, 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 uh. Well, that's a proper ending. It will lead us through the war of generations. There will be great sacrifice. Great sorrow to end the enslavement of the human race. Now is the time to claim our freedom. Are you with us? I am. Eve will lead us. Eve will lead us. What are you doing here? It is done. No, that's how it should have ended. So I technically finished it in about 8 hours, 8 and a bit. It's cool. Not too long, didn't really overstate welcome.
Now I have to redo my my second video to include this half hour. You, the player! <laughs> That's kind of cute that they're doing that. Uh, is there a voice cast? Yeah, it'll be soft. There's a lot of studios. That's enough for me, and that's enough for this. Is there anything else? Is there really anything for me to do here? Can't seem to trigger the map. Okay. That's it for Assassin's Creed Liberation. <laughs>